we'll guide you through how to download and install all the Mods 10 mod pack for Minecraft. If you find this useful, then please consider subscribing and liking the video. So this is a really great mod pack full of mods. So we'll guide you through how you can go and get it. So go and get started. What we need to do is go and quit Minecraft. Now, what we need to do is go and open up a web browser like so of your choice. I'm using Chrome, but it doesn't matter. Now, in order to do this, we're going to go and get a mod pack launcher. This is the best way I found of doing it. So what we need to do is go and search for something called Curse Forge. Go and search for it and come to curseforge.com. There are loads of different mods on here for different games, not just Minecraft. So what we can do is go to the top right and press get Curse Forge app like so. And then what you want to do is go and find the version download standalone at the bottom. Go and click here. Now it's super important to note for CurseForge to go and work, you do need to go and have Minecraft installed. If Minecraft isn't installed, it's not going to work. Now, before we start the install process, a big shout out to the sponsors of this video, Apex Hosting. They're my go-to Minecraft server host. Right now, you can get 30% off your first invoice. If you're interested, I'll put a link down below in the pinned comment and the description. So you can go and scroll down and you'll go and see the great features they offer here, like one click install mod packs. One of my favorite things is 24 seven servers and support. I mean, you can get the help anytime you need it amongst many other great features as well. So if you're interested, I'll put a link down below, which you can go and check out. Now let's go and start with the install process. What you need to do is go and open up your file explorer and come to your downloads and find the installer. Double click on it like so, and we can start this. We can press next. Make sure you accept the terms of use, the privacy policy, and confirm you're 18 years old. I've done that already, so I'll press next. Make sure you read through this, and you can then press accept and install if you do. I already have. When it opens up, you need to go to the left and go and locate Minecraft. You can go and see, there it is. Now, if it isn't appearing here, of course, make sure you have it installed. And then what you can do is press the plus, and we can add it. We can do a scan or manually go and add it. However, it should automatically go and find it. So there it is. Now, I've got quite a few mod packs here as I've gone and used CurseForge before. It's likely for you, this will be empty. At the top, go and press browse. And what we can do is go and press search. And then what we can do is go and type it in. All the mods, and it should go and appear when we type that in. As you can see, all the mods 10. So we can go and click on it and you can scroll down here and start going and checking it out just like that. But to go and actually get it, we need to go to the top right here and we can go and press install. And it's now gonna start the process. This may take a bit of time. It's got a lot of mods in there and quite a few things to download. So we'll just need to go and be patient. As you can see here, there are 400 mods to go and download, but it will just go and do it automatically. So you can just go and sit back and wait for the process. When it's finished, that install button will change to play, which you can click on. Also, you can go and press my mod packs over to the top left and you can go and see it here. Hover over it and go and press play. And then it's gonna go and do another install here. Just keep waiting. Here it is. And at the bottom, you can go and press play like so. Press play again. And now it's going to go and launch. Here we are now playing all the mods 10. And you're gonna go and see all these awesome mods in action and everything they go and add. It looks super cool. 